bro. Boy. So let's get into some world problems, bro. I mean, I have this is the this is the shit that I could have come up with last night, bro. You know, so you I know, also said you spelled said Ryan wrong. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's his rain. Rain? <laughs> Ray Ray Ann. Ray yeah. Ann. Ray Ann Garcia. Yeah, bro. It's all bro. Good. <coughs> I'm a little uh, on the spectrum myself. Yeah, bro. Feel feel a little spectrum me. Fuck yeah, bro. <laughs> that fucking debt though. That debt though, we are highest it's ever been in history. The thirty four trillion dollars in national debt. For real, bro. We're do you think that's real? Do you think it, or do you think they're just gonna bail us out like they usually do? So, I don't, honestly, so you know who the tell. Fed is, right? Huh? You know who the Fed is, right? The Fed? Yeah. Well, the Federal Reserve. Federal Reserve. They usually Prince currency. they, they mm-hmm. bond us out with treasure, uh, treasury treasury bonds. bonds. Yeah. And those treasury bonds fucking accumulate. They mm-hmm. they turn into dollars, which means they, they print money. It just they out just of print thin air. Money out of, thr- out out of, of fucking thin, thin air. air. Yeah. So, people that are like uh, other countries, they buy these treasury bonds. Mm-hmm. Like, they buy these treasury bonds, and that's the real money. Yeah, that's how the United States gets its real money because these other countries buy these treasury bonds from the yeah. United States. So, like, um, when you exchange money and shit like that, brother, like you fucking gotta, you gotta buy treasury bonds from the United States so you can get some sort of exchangeable funds. Yeah, that's how you get treasury bonds. And that's how they fucking deal with this shit. I'm pretty sure that's what they do, bro. Yeah. These motherfuckers. So who do you, who do you think is going to buy us out, bro? Russia or China, bro? <laughs> uh, I don't think anybody's going to buy us out. I think they're going to fucking come and just take it out. Take us I out. I feel like Russia don't even got the funds either right now. Considering they're in a war, like right now. Mm-hmm. And I think Russia I think. has more than capability to fucking do whatever the fuck they want. I don't mm-hmm. know, bro. I don't think so. With everything that's going on, bro, all their all their troops are dying and shit. You know, they just keep mm-hmm. sending people. Eventually, there's gonna be no people to send, bro. Eventually, everybody's gonna be dead. Yeah. Well, I seen on some clips that fucking Ukraine did a fucking massive graveyard. Holy shit! Have you guys shit. seen that shit, bro? <coughs> uh huh. Yeah, cause apparently, I don't know. Who knows? The media is fucking completely manipulating everything. You know, so they're obviously controlling the yeah. narrative. So, but supposedly, I guess like Ukraine just invested in a massive fucking graveyard because by the looks of it they're losing the war bro. fuck who, who knows who knows to be honest but but what do you think about gonna, Zelensky well he had his who's his Zelensky the you president of Ukraine, Ukraine, right? Ukraine right? oh yeah, yeah. um <laughs> I mean it, he had his his recognition for a couple a couple of time back when the war started do you know he was a comedian I know. Yeah, I've seen the clips of him just doing some. Did you dumb see him shit. dancing? Yeah. Like, and like with his dick too, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like his cock, huh? Yeah, his dick, yeah. <laughs> but <coughs> it's weird, bro. It's, it's moving around, huh? Was yeah, it dude. flopping and jiggling and diggling or what? Well, they didn't I show didn't that. Look at that. They didn't show that. They didn't show that. Obviously, it wasn't his, you know, shit, but. <laughs> I seen one where, he, where he's like in a. Like in. Like nets. Like, you know, yeah. like girl nets. You know how they wear nets? Sometimes fishnets, fishnets. Fish ah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I don't even know what they're called. <coughs> yeah, of course you know how to, what they're called. Davy, Davy be uh, changing clothes. Not Friday me. Nights. Fuck that shit. I ain't gay. <laughs> Miss me with that no, gay. You see gay. me, you're, queso. You're not this gay. This is just, me. Just this trying. is gay shit, and it missed you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I always tell him. Yeah. All right, all right. Relax, relax. Not, not that I have anything against gay people. If you're gay, yeah, go do it by all means, but. Yeah, Not like me. Well, you gotta be such a homophobe, bro. <laughs> it's all good, bro. No, we're all not being homophobic. We're no, just bro. Trying to, we're trying to keep the peace. Keep the peace, bro. Well, you know, though. one of us in the room is homo, right? Every three out of uh, <laughs> one out of three. One men. out of three men. <laughs> <laughs> I'm <ain't> fucking gay. <laughs> we could all guess who the gay guy is. Ah, <clears throat> <sighs> it's gay, so hobby. Uh, <laughs> <what>? <laughs> You're making anyway, me more nervous now, you, bro. <laughs> what do you think is going on with this little with uh, this crazy thing, Ryan Garcia? Ryan Garcia, bro. Ah, dude, it's so. Oh, it's so. Show show him the video that you showed me, Javi. With Which the, one? I don't think he watched it. it. I don't think it was a video. It was a it was a TikTok like a like a slideshow, right? 
because they're pointing a, out the tattoo. So, yeah, but it was uh, it was like there's that's the video. Mm -hmm. You should look up the actual video and see if it's true or not. Because I mean, we seen the clip on TikTok, right, about mm -hmm. him not having the tattoo. But is it true that the tattoo wasn't there? Or? Well, I looked at his tattoos and he like he doesn't have anything on his neck. Foo. He just has them like right here. But there's a, a specific tattoo he has on his hand. It's like an eyeball or something. Mm. Mm. That's crazy. Well, this is just... Look, Ryan Garcia hand tattoo. Not in video or something. Tattoo or Ryan Garcia tattoo AI or something. Mm -hmm. Tattoo video. Oh, shit. Hand. Damn, I'm fucking up right now. My boy is feeling it. <laughs> That one? It's not that him. One. Look at his tattoo. That one, right, though? Yeah, it's that video, yeah. But what video is this off of? What? I don't know. Well, who, who the fuck knows? Like I said, it's just like, it, with the power of AI, bro, I mean, you, you got to think about how much, like, when some people, oh, my God, you got to be kidding me. <laughs> Why does he have a crown? I don't know. That's what he always wears. King Ryan. Unless it's makeup. Why would he put makeup on his tattoos, though? For what reason? Huh. Now let's go look at Ryan Garcia. A picture of Ryan Garcia and his fucking. Look up Ryan Garcia hand tattoo. In the images? Yeah. Nah, he doesn't have nothing. Well, he has like a faded eye. I, I, I see kind of like a faded eye. That's yeah, that's it's yeah. like on his wrist. Mm -hmm, in his it's wrist. Not, it's right? not on his fucking. Yeah, is it not his on wrist? His hand. Okay, but what are the odds that now that bro, we're searching it up, it's you gone? It's not this. popping up, yeah. You can see this. No, like no, right this here. was a different video, Javi, that you sent me, remember? You sent it to us on TikTok, I think. Let me see if I can. Well, that, that, that's what I mean by it's all the all the things that are shown on social media, they're just so manipulated. Here, let me. Because of the power of AI, dude. It's it's getting this is, so It is hand. pretty fucking scary, bro, because fucking. I think you dude. sent it on TikTok. Mm -hmm. Might have. Oh my god, we're almost to 100 followers on fucking... It's this video. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that's the slideshow. Yeah, look. Well, I mean, in here, in this photo, I think you can kind of see the hand tat, no? Yeah, look, look, Javi, that's that. Yeah. Mm. He doesn't have it, in case but he doesn't <laughs> have it there either, look. I know, yeah, he does right there. Oh yeah, right here. Oh, yeah, it's he on does. his right hand. He does mm. have it. So you see... I mean, but it's showing his left hand in that mm -hmm. in that picture, so they're capping left, about it. Yeah, right. You see, so they're trying to manipulate so the media. I kind of feel like this kind of goes to the fact that this could be just for clout. Yeah, because he has it on his right hand, right? Oh yeah, I see people are saying it's. But then inverted. some people, some of my clients were telling me that there was a video of him showing Bohemian Grove. Yeah, there. He said he has a video of it, but I never seen it, it released. It yeah, was he just it. talked about it on the on the Ryan. Uh, uh, what is it? The tape podcast mm -hmm. talked about it on that, and that's where that came out from. He called the podcast. Mm -hmm. When he called the podcast, he was telling him like, "Hey, uh, I seen I have video footage of me getting held down, getting raped." On my, he's like, "You have this on your phone, then, huh?" Not him getting raped. Someone, yeah, kid, so little some kids. little kids getting raped, but they tied him down and made him watch. Some little kids. Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah. Have you seen the the video? I have not. So I'm not, well, <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be gone. I feel like. Look at, give it a goog, Havo. Give it a goog. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Javi. And then, uh, <laughs> we always do this to you. Yeah, Javi. I know, bro. <laughs> Fuck it. I, I should, I should have told you to bring your laptop, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I have it. <laughs> um, so we usually, what? Bring, we usually bring it. Yeah, I do have it, but I, I just don't like to bring my laptop on here, and it's your show, you know. Yeah, so bro. It's like, of course. Why would I? <laughs> You know, so yeah, you gotta run it, brother. You because Bohemian Grove, shit, this one right here, was from uh, Alex Jones, wasn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. Alex Jones. Alex Jones. <coughs> so, hmm, so there's yeah, like we're saying, I don't think there's like a video of his specifically, mm -hmm. but he's talking about it on the mm -hmm. Andrew Tate podcast. Yeah, and yeah. I think that's that's it right there. To be honest, though, this one right here. 
Um, yeah, we're asking to get this fucking episode shut down, bro. <laughs> oh, fuck them. Do you think they're going to shut us down? Huh? We're here Hell yeah, they will. Okay, so they got so much time. power, bro. Yeah, if they already took out Ryan Garcia, bro. Imagine what they would do to us. We're nobodies. Yeah. We have no intentions of killing ourselves. Of course yep, not. so if somebody fucking kills us, it wasn't us. Unless I kill fucking Queso for not hitting record on the video or something, I'll <laughs> fucking murder That might him. happen. <laughs> you gotta help me, dude. If that <laughs> happens... <laughs> what's gonna happen, bro? I'm gonna kill Queso because he did, sometimes he doesn't start the video. <laughs> yeah, like this last episode. You, you didn't start the video? We went for a whole, like, two hours. Okay, so... Damn! So, what, what did you guys... Are you guys gonna post that audio or what? No. There's there's no audio. There's no audio? There's no audio? <laughs> <laughs> we fucked up. We got too stoned for the podcast. Nothing. <laughs> nothing. We nothing didn't do no. nothing. We just took a gut... Just sat down and talked for two hours. You know that's good for us. Though. Yeah, I mean uh, it's good. Fucking. Just, <laughs> we yeah, still got we, like an hour and what thirty minutes. Case yeah, what? yeah, but two hours, almost uh, an hour and a half gone. Uh huh. It's pretty sad, dude. <laughs> that's yeah. That sucks, bro. Because <laughs> we, we get, oh, dude, that show was fucking probably a good ass conversation. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I can't find it on Google. I mean, on the messages. Uh. Yeah, it's in our messages. If you go to mm-hmm. our messages, mm-hmm. shit, I don't even have the messages linked here. Ooh. Oh, fuck. oh, that's so damn. Uh, okay, look up uh, Ryan Garcia, <laughs> Andrew Tate podcast. Is there any way we could call. screenplay to your TV? Send, do you guys have it on the messages? Because if you guys have the messages, send it to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah send it to me. It'll through, pop up there through right my now. number. Yeah, because because usually I don't receive it on the laptop because it's shut down, like fully out of battery. <laughs> you know. Oh yeah. So here, uh, send. I'll send mm. something. Here's the video right here. What was it? The first one, Queso? Huh? Look, there's a... What's this video? Which one was it? That uh, t- I yes, got the it. the very first one. That I'm one? Send it oh, I'll, I'm a god. I got raped. <laughs> yeah, that's the one where he says, he, I'm a god. But I, I feel like they're just making it look like... They're just, you know... Making him look crazy instead yeah. of actually... Scary, I did send it to you, though, Javi. Oh, you sent it to me? Video, yeah. About. Can ads oh no, ads. stop it. Fucking ads. ads. Fucking ads. I hate you ads. No free ads here. No free ads. Did send no. to it or no? Oh no. That sucks. Nope. Damn, I am I I, I might not have the messages linked to it, but oh well. Just Fuck yeah, play it. that video. Let's see if that's it. But there's an ad, bro. <laughs> Skip that motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh cool. Yo, Andrew. This is it. Hey, That's right, it? Talk to us. This is a phone call. Oh, yeah, I seen that. See, this is where he's saying he has a video, but mm-hmm. I've never seen the video, so. Yeah, me either. Well, that's the thing. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, this could just be Fake. for, for you know, just to bring attention because he's going to have our next fight, right? He's going to have another fight. But why would why would he say something like that? Do you know who's hanging why out? Why kids, you know bro? who's uh, hanging out with Diddy res- recently? Ryan Garcia? No, <laughs> his, his opponent. His opponent? Devin Haney. Devin Haney. So he's about to fight Devin Haney mm-hmm. next month. Or 420. 420. That's when they fight. Yeah. Devin Haney was hanging out with Diddy. Uh-huh. According to what's been going on, I don't know if you've been hearing. Yeah, Diddy's been Diddy's fucking been people. Fucking people since the 90s. Uh-huh. So maybe. Si- not just 80s. fucking them, like raping them and telling them, hey, uh, you're not going to get this deal if you don't fuck me. You know? And Meek Mill came out and said that something happened to him. Something happened, bro? I don't know exactly what he said because I haven't done my own research on it, obviously. Do you want me to go get the... <coughs> my Gatorade, maybe? Tea? Oh, no, I mean, yeah, I'm you good. good. You good? I'm good, yeah. Did you like it, Queso? You liked it? I'm gonna, I, I mean, uh... I'm just kidding. I'm just go, kidding. Go, 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 go get it, bro. Can you get my Gatorade? Yeah, I got it's, it. it's in the... Um, dude, I don't know, bro. I, I didn't really get too much into this, either. Just because... We, we do know Bohemian Grove is real. 
Yeah, it's, it's just, definitely it's real. No, uh, it, people have been doing it, but imagine you just have so much fucking money, bro. Should go like this, Harvey. Go like that, bro. Like like that? Why yeah. is it too poofy? Yeah, it was like <laughs> too poofy. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. Looks bro. nice now, though. No, I need to cut the top, bro. I'm a barber now. I don't need to cut my hair. Do you cut your own hair? Huh? Nah, nah. The, the Enrique cuts me up right here. Oh yeah. Yeah, but no, I need to get it cut soon. I'm just getting too out of hand right here. That's crazy. You don't cut your own hair, Javi. I know. I should. I could. I'm pretty sure I could. Oh, it's just brand I just new. I'd rather not. This is brand new. Mine is in the room. I'll get that one, bro. Fuck it. No, no, I don't want to open it. <laughs> um, it's very wasteful, Javi. It's I am not good, a wasteful bro. man. I am a man. We live in America, bro. It's everything's wasted in America, bro. Yeah, I just try not to do it, I guess. <laughs> yeah. you know? It's kind of fucked up. Yeah. Dude, that shit is crazy, but... I don't know, bro. This is too... Just too... Uh, to me, this just seems like just more... Just more attention. So people are more tuned into this. If if it if it's actually genuine, this is going to get... He's going to get shut down. Like yeah, They're probably gonna, even going to cancel the fight. To that point, I feel like. If it's really genuinely real... There's obviously a reason that they took him over there. If they did take him over there, there's a reason that they took him over there. Obviously, mm-hmm. he had to have joined some type of uh, some type of. <laughs> yeah, no, you're good, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he can't see My out of those fucking glasses. <laughs> you didn't even get your twisted tea. I already drank it. Oh shit! You chugged it or what? <sighs> it's all good, bro. I'm a little excited. Yeah, <laughs> is it, that, that was any for you now. <laughs> yeah, dude. It was just a. Li- it was just like like that. Mm-hmm. I don't know. So that is crazy, though, honestly. Yeah, dude. It's, uh, I didn't, like I said, bro, it's, I didn't get just too deep just because everything is just so fake, bro. Yeah. That's what I was saying to David. I was like, you don't think it's kind of weird that they're putting all that shit and trying to, you know, like, change the fact that there's something else going on right Mm -hmm. now? Yeah. The fact yeah. that Trump is winning in elections. Oh yeah, dude. The fact that nobody is going to Biden's fucking uh, when he the goes fact that that dude even won, bro, is crazy still to me. Who Biden? But Bi- he won. Like I'm saying, like he won to be president last time, uh-huh. last election. How the fuck did that? He how did well, you motherfuckers let this with happen? With Obama, bro, he was with Obama, so he had the credentials. <laughs> Have you seen right? the the conspiracy theory that? Uh, Fucking. He sniffs kids. No, that Barack Obama is the one running the show, and that I, I, that I've seen some clips, but have you ever seen that clip where Barack Obama is like, if I could ever do it again, I, I, maybe have if I could have somebody. You would have did a way better I, job than this dumb like, fuck. If I could be in my basement, wearing my pajamas, calling the shots, I would do it. No, I that ass, bro. Look it up. It's yeah. crazy. How do I say Obama? Obama. I'm a would he run under his basement or something like that? I don't know. President Obama post phone a third term run YouTube. That's probably that one. If I were Obama. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Michelle Obama. and Malia Obama would be also running with me. Oh, you mean Michael <laughs> Obama? <laughs> the Obamas, they're, they're great people. They're, they're just great, but we're having, we're having a rough time. <laughs> Damn ads. We're yeah, a rough I, time. I had to get him I out of the White ads. House. I had to get him out. Such President Barack Obama people. joked Tuesday that he could win a third term office people. during an address to the African Union. Also say that African democratic progress is also at risk when leaders refuse to step aside when the terms have. Is it Kezo? No. Is that that one? No. He, it, the other one's like a weird one, bro. He's like in a. Let me be honest with you. I do not understand this. Hmm. Go down, go down. Go down, go down. Yeah. You should maybe you should put conspiracy theory on there. <coughs> fucking everybody I think you should put That's uh, how people dismiss it nowadays. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. how you dismiss things. Like Obama say says conspiracy. if he could run America in his basement, he would. I feel Shit. like that would be a good way to look it up. Queso's capping about this. No, no, I'm pretty sure he's not. He's but capping. It's, <laughs> it, it's just you can't see it. There's so much. There's so much. There's so much. And if it's a meme, it could it's going to get taken down. If it's fake, yeah, it's also going to get taken down. Right, so, so 
But imagine, imagine to. Do you mind if we hit this yeah, on go here? Ahead, go ahead, yeah. Go, go ahead. ahead. I go just want to make sure. I just already hit it. Goddamn, yeah. I'm a fucking heathen. So you can smack me with the white gloves if you, you want. You got this like long hair on your beard, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's better. <laughs> Like Damn, bro, you're you just judging everyone, bro. It's because well, I'll be honest, bro. <laughs> you, got, <laughs> you got no fucking hair. Yeah, because I shave my face, dude. You got actually. Matter of fact, Javi, this motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck you, and me oh. made a bet. <clears throat> he made a bet, dude, on Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. Right. That fuck. He said he didn't want to go through with it though. The whole time he didn't want to go through with it. But when his team won. Then he wanted to go through with it. That's yeah. not how it works. Duh. He's like, we didn't even shake hands. <laughs> yeah, we didn't it's shake pod, hands. Dude. It's on the pod, right? Well, what was the bet? He needs to shave his mustache. You wouldn't never shave your mustache? Why? Bro, I look <laughs> like a fucking 10-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> I already look young. Okay, the other day I went to the scrapyard, right? You look like a map. A map? <laughs> <laughs> I told him that he looks like the rapist. You know what a map is, bro? Bro, he looks like the rapist and the fucking victim. <laughs> map, my neuroattractive person. <laughs> That's the new term they're calling for pedoph pedophiles, bro. Did you see that shit? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Map? Map, yeah. That's what you're calling people now? Well, so I think they're trying <laughs> to pass a bill that... Not you, obviously you, but people are obviously... No, no, no. no it's a joke, bro. Obviously you don't... That, that's queso. <laughs> queso has a van and he drives around and... Dude, just because I got a van don't mean I be... <laughs> You'll be taking in kids in there, bro? I don't be doing that, motherfuckers. <laughs> he puts free Wi-Fi on the side. <laughs> 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 Real, real. You motherfucker, dude. <laughs> you motherfucker. That's fucked up, dude. How? <laughs> but who came up with that term, Javi? Uh, so I think there was a bill. Oh, yeah. You sent us a, a bill passed for Yeah, this? they're trying to pass a bill. I don't know. I, I heard on Joe Rogan. There's no There's a bill way. that was being trying to be passed for uh, what they're calling MAP, minor attracted person, Bro. to not be uh, having too much penalty if they get caught doing that. So they're going to just, you know, all right, don't do that again. Here, let me see. Mm. Map. Backpack, 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 backpack. Where's the map, Queso? Where's the map? Pull it out, you dude. You got it. <laughs> oh, it's in my ass. My unattracted person wants acceptance from LGBTQ. Mm. Holy oh, shit. What is that? Is that a uh, backpack, backpack? The new thing now? Maps? Map is an umbrella term that includes sexual attraction to prepubescent pre individuals, but also includes sexual attraction to peri and post pubescent individuals. Which means po like post Which, yeah. puberty. Nah, bro, what the fuck? You're fucking kidding me. All right, this is from a university. Oh, what fucking? Long dark what is this world coming to, Javi? Dude, I don't fucking know, dude. This is. This is are we be. are we really stuck in a fucking parallel universe? Are we? Did we fucking enter a universe that just after COVID, dude, it just fucking. Bro, this this feels like a South Park episode. <laughs> seriously, <laughs> this is where we are, dude. This feels like a, seriously a South Park episode where this just nothing makes fucking Want sense. Acceptance from <laughs> nothing make absolute sense, bro. Which is. Wow, it's interesting because, bro, there's some fucked up people that really want to hurt, like in the, the society. Let's, let's the watch society. this, and I got some, I got something to say too about the this. LGBTQ it's crazy. Fox 26 Houston. They said they will never, dude. This comes At least that's good. Known as Maps. Maps is looking for a home there. They want to add their letters, Maps, M A P S, to LGBTQ. Maps stands for Minor Attracted People. Minor Attracted Adults Attracted to Children. We can't make it up. And if you the think fuck? What? <laughs> Shit's crazy, you know, bro. Oh, that should be normalized, bro. They are pedophiles. That that's fucking pedophilia. They don't act on their attraction. People always be acting on that shit, bro. That's the thing. Like, how well, many how is that not there? evil and devious? It's just we don't, we don't 
don't want to even to don't entertain want them. it. Yeah, exactly. No, it's just a way for them to try to um, take the stigma off of pedophilia and as a sex part of the LGBT community. <laughs> I'm glad Fox is on on the board on this. For real. That's odd. This is just it's just a distraction. Um, I've never heard a single queer person uh, even consider adding this to our community. Like this is just craziness. This is not I don't even know. I think it was uh, the professor that got fired from her her university, right? For for even yeah. writing a paper about this. What was it? I think her name his name, I think it's they. Um, well, you, that, you see how that makes it so fucking confusing? Uh, she, God. She, they. Pretty much <laughs> She's having a hard time too. Minor, Who wouldn't? And she's a sexpert. Uh, sexpert? As a, as a <laughs> you didn't see that's what it said her name. Under her name it said sexpert. I think that's enough, Bobby. We've seen enough. Of <laughs> <laughs> I've seen enough you guys got to be fascinated by this absurdity, bro. Bro. This is crazy, dude. Yeah, so it's obviously this but is this a has been going on for years, Javi. This has been going on for years. So yeah. I'll be, I was watching this uh, documentary on uh, fucking Netflix yesterday mm-hmm. called The Program. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's the one you're talking and about? And literally these... Uh, these kids that are like troubled kids that are getting getting in trouble, having trouble in school. They um, let's say you get expelled from school, you get sent to this program, and your parents think you're in a, the best program in the in the United States, but in real all reality, you're getting uh, what's it called, beat. You're getting child abused. Like kids are made uh, clean. Like have uh to make their own foods like they're running the whole school bro on their own the whole kids and crazy as fuck they have these kids like think that they're mentally ill bro they have these kids talk about how they're uh what's it called first they have them like they break them down and tell them that they're nothing and they make them go through stages bro Mm -hmm. like you go to stage one and it takes so long like you it's a point system Mm -hmm. and then if you're like you can't smile you can't like do anything bro if you smile it's show a dedu- or what? yeah there's a deduction of points bro if like if there's a room in every room and the door's uh off there's mm-hmm. no door when you go to the bathroom you have to sit in the bathroom <laughs> open keep the stall oh, open. i ain't taking a shit and, at like, the store what the well, fuck dude, the stall they'd be watching you they'd be watching you imagine you have to go bro. i start you beating my really meat go. you want to watch me motherfucker you want to watch me <laughs> they'll fucking take you in the back and they'll well, that's destroy the thing, you bro they were, <laughs> they were they were beating the shit out of these kids bro beating the i'd shit keep out doing of these it kids. i just keep there getting was my rooms called the, there was a room where they had no cameras and they would beat the fuck out of kids the rooms where they had cameras Bro, they would beat the kids already, bro. What documentary imagine? is that, bro? It's called The Program. Is this on real? Netflix. Is this yeah, a true it's story? real, bro. The it's program. a true story. And most of these parents, bro, they were in a cult. Oh. They were in a cult. Netflix they, duck. God they damn. Br- they brought them in, Javi. Like, they Academy got all these parents together. And, like, they had, like, um, what do you... What are your homies at right now? At a uh, uh, convention. Convention. Yeah. Okay, so they would have conventions for these mm-hmm. parents, right? And have these parents show up. The kid, the parents that are, for like, that have their kids at that school. Mm-hmm. So they would have them show up. They would do weird rituals with the kid, with the parents, bro. And then the they would fuck? like have them pay money because obviously they got to keep their kids in the school. Yeah. Like, tell them, look, your kid is doing really good. We're trying to have them help them out. Eventually, the kids found out that there was no way to get out because they even rioted. They threw a riot, bro. They threw a big ass riot mm-hmm. and they like beat the shit out of all the teachers. They went crazy. Yeah. But, spoiler alert: they fucking. With uh, these guys, they realized that they weren't getting out. Even after the riot, bro, the the school got more intense. Mm-hmm. And it wasn't in school, bro. When these kids graduated this place, bro, mm-hmm. they uh found out that the the fucking certificates their fucking G, like their GED or their high school diploma was fake. What the hell? Damn. It was fake. So all these, that ass beat. Yes, no bro, so they these people like when they try to go to like apply for college, they want to accept bro. Them. 
you don't have an high school diploma. Not, this is nothing. You don't this have a fake. school record, bro. This in, is at all. Yeah, it's like, bro, what the fuck are you talking about? And that's how they started getting up to these, the school. Mm-hmm. But meanwhile, bro, they didn't find out. A lot of kids, bro, went through this program and they had to go through it. They had to lie that say that they were doing drugs and say that they were doing things so that they could get the fuck out of that program. Mm-hmm. Once they got out, bro, we're talking about there was no internet back then. MySpace yeah. was barely about to start. So when MySpace comes on, these kids start looking for each other food on mm-hmm. MySpace. Bro, they get together and they create this documentary. And they look for these teachers, bro. If you have a chance to look at this fucking documentary, it's go crazy. look at it. It's yeah. fucking crazy. It w- it made me sad for shit. Like, you. Shit, you should the shit out of these kids. Should look up the true story, Javi, and see. Well, that's her. That's her right there. That's that right girl. Oh, the, this the, one? That girl right there. Yeah. Yeah. That's Ten most right shocking there. reveals from a Netflix program documentary. That's her. Yeah. Oof. That's her. And that this is just one of the girls that's there. There's a lot of. Um, kids on there there's a kid where he says that he just got beat the fuck up just because because of cause existing he was, he was weird <coughs> you want me to read it Harvey? yeah go go read it bro. all go right netflix it, right? documentary <laughs> series the program cons cults and kidnapping reveals horrifying details about what happened inside the academies at ivy ridge told from the perspective of former attendees directed by Catherine. the program details the typical experience of ivy ridge attendee through ivy ridge was marked to the public as a boarding school that aimed to reform troubled teens, something much darker was happening inside. Jesus Christ. Look, uh, it says these other the facilities have been shut down in the past due to reports, mistreatment towards attendees. Um, yeah. Oh, shit. They Did repeated. I fuck up? No, you're good. <laughs> you're good. I just, I just wanted to read What that happened to okay. it? I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's there right you go. <laughs> attendees, yeah, even with these uh, truth, truths brought to light. Damn, bro. They, so they they did. They still let them run for a while, bro. Yeah. Shit. And then the parents, even after like, there was still parents that they didn't believe them, bro. Damn, they it says it was shut kids. down by the government. The parents didn't believe them, and in Mexico, bro, they they. There's had, multiple of these cases. Bro, they had a lot. They had like. Utah, several, Costa bro. Rica, Mexico. Yeah, bro. They had several of these. Yeah. The program in Mexico reveals all got shut down. And they sent all those kids from the ones that were in Mexico down to the United States, bro. God damn. Have you seen the the church from Mexico, bro? Like the La, La Luz del Quinta Have you seen that? What is that? Oh, what it's is that? it's it was a church uh, that they would lure. You know, it's like a cult, bro. Like a, a angelic evangelical church, uh-huh. right? They would lure all these people, right? And then the the so f- like the the guy that was being called by God. He would just be in power with all the governors, right? And then they would take all these women, bro. And the 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 main head of the church would just rape them all, bro. All the women, bro. So it was a cult. Yeah. What kind dude. of church was it, though? What, what did they believe in? What is that? Uh, I have no fucking idea. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> I never heard of that. No, I know what I'm angelico. I don't know what I'm angelico is, honestly. I don't even think I have a helico. I have a helico. What did? Have a helico. What did you say? Eva, uh, La luz del mundo. Evangelist. Yeah, right here. This one. Oh fuck. Current uh, location. Uh, don't allow. <laughs> <laughs> they always ask me that every. So yeah, time. this guy got locked up, and people still believed he was innocent, when there was hundreds of, of cases of women. So, like how the hell they believe he's innocent then? Because <laughs> because he's just so powerful. He is running such a huge cult of followers, bro. Th- that wow. they all believe he was talked so, to by God. So listen, listen to me. I've heard th- you never watched that video of that dude where he's like, "I'm the son of the go- I'm the son of the go- uh, the sun." The sun. So el hijo de sol y la luna. He's like a chubby guy, and he's like in getting arrested. Look up. That guy? Look up. <laughs> El hijo de sol y la luna. That's him, bro. That's him? Oh my god, that's him, bro. <laughs> Look, so that's the guy Dude, that was running the, that was running the fucking church. Bro, that's him. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, David. <laughs> David, I seen the video of this dude. It's in Mexico, bro. Yeah, look yeah, him yeah. up. Look him up on the video. Yeah. Let's look up the video. Well, bro. the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy so, fuck. so, so here, let me let me screenshot this. Crazy. <laughs> Damn, uh, you I don't know what that is. It's in Spanish. Uh huh. Oh, it's in Spanish. Yeah. 
Oh, well, I'll, uh, I'll put it, it says, there still. It says <laughs> <laughs> I could read it for you and we could translate it real quick. Even la luz del mundo. Hold on, wait, wait. In English, I'm going to just put it in English. Just for the English speaking audience. See, see, it's right there. Teaches right there. Right here, this one. Teaches, teaches that it is the only true Christian church founded by Jesus Christ because it is led by Nasan, Joaquin, whom, whom it considers the only true ser servant of God and opposite of Jesus Christ in the, this era. Yeah, so that this is actually Netflix, the documentary. So Right, so which one? You wanted me to pull up the video, right? Yeah, I want to see the video. Of the, right well, like the trailer yeah. of the no, fucking... Because there's the trailer right here. Hijo de Sol y la Luna, and then put subtitles so you so how this motherfucker can understand. It's fucking hilarious. La Luna meme? <laughs> it's, on, it's on YouTube, bro. It's like... On you, you want me to go to YouTube? Yeah, you can. Shit's pretty crazy. I never heard about any of this, to be honest. Oh, no, dude, it's insane. because so a big-ass cult. I didn't know. I thought he was just fucking... I thought he was just... He's like, where's my... Donde esta mi carroza? Mm -hmm. He's like, where's my chariot? Yeah, so his father, right? El, his father would... That was all... Her, all those churches were from his great-great-grandfather, right? I'm not like sure. Some oh, that's a, crazy I didn't even lineage. know that was real, bro. I didn't know this yeah, was real. Yeah, it was real. It's still running to this day. Okay, so Damn. let's see it. Yeah. Let's Bush see just it. hit me. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm... Uh, in the I don't huh? Know. Huh? Wait, what? I'm somewhere else right now. Oh, oh, oh. Damn, those twisted hits hit, hit you, bro? No. The edibles are... Oh, oh, you guys are gone. <laughs> like that. Oh, <laughs> Oh no! I'm 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 like boom, and then you guys are like boom, right? Yeah. Damn. Good luck, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was in the beginning of the podcast, but I'm I'm back to normal, boys. Woo! Okay, so hijo de la luna or del sol y la luna. It's only yes. coming up with fucking music, queso. No, because they made a lot of fucking memes about him, bro. Yeah, dude. Uh, these are all songs. He's right bro. there. He's right there. This in one the car, in the car. That one. No, top one. <laughs> oh, this is a meme. No, it's a complete. I'll put the subtitles. subtitles where's the CC right here? Yep. Oh, where's the uh, where's the right there, uh, setting? settings and then uh, subtitles? Oh, yep. yep. Boom. Wow. Automated and then it'll ask you which one you want. Oh damn! Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Translated English. Well, that's weird voice. And what weird noise it just made. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, that's like Queso's fat ass dog. That yeah, you did, dude. <laughs> Queso's dog is fat as fuck, boy. I'm just Look, kidding. Great. I love the Harla. The meme or what? No, it's not. See, it's the whole video. Huh? Wait, wait, hold on, hold on, wait. Is this the? This is the actual video. Oh, that's the actual video? Yeah. Holy shit. Wait, that's not. Wait, are, the one I was talking about. That was not him, though. That's him, fool. He just looks bearded up. And they shaved his head. Oh. So that's the same guy. You sure? Sure that's the same guy, Queso? Yeah. It's that's not that same guy, bro. Look him up, bro. Huh? Look, it's the same. Look the picture. It's the same guy. Just because he has his long hair right there, bro. No, it's no, no. Because that's six years. Nason, that's Nason. That's not Nason. The the guy from the from the other article, right? Or mm, that's what he just said. 
He's Nason. He said, soy, soy el hijo de Nason. Oh, el hijo de Nason. Yeah, so that's his son. He's like, I'm the, I'm the twilight and I'm the, I'm the darkest in the night or in the day. I'm the darkest in the day mm -hmm. and the brightest in the, in, in the night. Mm -hmm. It's like, what the fuck? Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, okay, wait, so let me go to Google then. Watch, because look at his face. When you see his face, it just, look at his fucking face. This is old though, bro. That, that guy? Yeah. This is old, bro. 1.2 million views. What the fuck? Here, so here, let me go to Google real quick. Yeah, look up that other guy, because that don't look like the same guy, okay? So you. No, if he said if he's the son of the fucking. It's the same one, bro. You're saying they're like the same. They they represent the same thing. Yes. You're not saying they're the no, same they guy. No, could be the same guy. Look. Now, son Joaquin Garcia, bro. That's, he said it's his son, David. Not him. But he didn't say I'm. Yes, his he son. did. I'm the son of Nason. He said, "I'm the son of the." Because um, that's the guy that yeah. got locked up. Look up his son. Uh, that's why I put. It might not be him. Like yeah. his son. It might not be him. What if they all fucking just think they're all his kids? But that's yeah. Who knows? Bro, that might be crazy. it. I thought like that was a meme. <laughs> that's so crazy, bro. Look at him there, bro. See mm -hmm. right there in this, in this when he's in the jail over here down here. Down yeah, right there. Right there, he kind of looks like him there. No. So you're saying all Mexicans look alike, bro? That are chubby? <laughs> mm, I didn't say that. You did. <laughs> 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 I'm just kidding. Oh man, dude, I that's. I think um, me and Javier are about to throw a party and drink some more twisted teas and. Uh, Oh man, party nah, bro. Can't party, bro. Yeah, we're bring partying the, right now, bring dude. Bring the baby, dude. Bring Talk the baby. Yeah. Oh, definitely not, bro. Bring the baby, <laughs> dude, <laughs> bro. Bring the baby. Put her over there in her crib, dude. We'll freaking put the music on low. Yeah, bro. She'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah bro. this shit's pretty crazy, though. Yeah. So, <sighs> fuck. Um, I you don't, don't know, watch bro. the UFC, huh, Harvey? I didn't watch the UFC, but I seen that. Uh, what's his name? One, Sean O'Malley. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. That was nice. You should, uh, what was the other guy that fought Queso before that? Dustin Poirier. Yeah, Dustin Poirier. did you see that one? I did not see that one. Oh, he knocked day, bro. his ass out, yeah. Let me see. Let me see that shit, bro. He knocked his ass out, boy. He did. Oh, it was nice. Where's the highlights? No highlights? I don't know if they'll show them. Knockout, look at knockout. We'll probably just show like a clip of it, you know? Saint Denis. It's Saint Denis. He's that one? Saint Denis. That one has to be that one. Yeah, Saint. Yeah. Oh, it feels nice to come somewhere else and do a podcast. Yeah, bro. Yeah, you guys, you guys liking the vibe, bro? On a yeah. Sunday night or a Sunday morning? Still in the morning. It's 11.30 in the morning, bro. What? It's 11.30 and we're all horny? What? Is it not playing or what? <laughs> Davey's on the spectrum, if you guys don't know that. Dude, can you stop being a dick? I'm sorry. Dave doesn't like when I point out the facts. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> are you guys this, this rude to each other, bro? Is that how, how close you guys are? Queso's okay. just a bitch. That you guys just, like, roast each other? Yeah, like crazy? This, this, I think uh, a relationship, a friend should mm -hmm. coexist of uh, roasting. If you yeah. don't get roasted, we yeah. don't roast you. You don't, yeah. you're not our friend. You know, yeah. you don't get roasted. But, but, I could probably but pull it up in my but phone. But you, you know, you know when it gets just to the personal point, just because like you're annoyed. He gets a little agitated. <laughs> Look, Javi. Uh -huh. Send Watch me that clip shit. on on my phone. On my phone. All right. Knocks him out pretty sick. Mm -hmm. Watch him show it. Look at him laying on the floor like a fucking pussy. America, motherfucker. Yeah, <laughs> America. Donald Trump was. Oh, there. Uh, this really shows knockout, but he falls yeah. right there. Donald you Trump know. was there. I'll send this to Donald you. Donald Trump was there. Yeah, send that. Send, send those clips. Your president was there. My mom was all. Your president, bro. You mean? Your president, dude. I don't got no political. Uh, Why are you choice, lying, bro? dude? You're lying, dude. <laughs> Who are you voting for this year, dude, or next year? I can't disclaim that to him. I can't vote. You know, I can't vote. Not gonna vote at all. Back in the day, Javi, you were able to say. 
<laughs> Why the fuck are you asking me that? Fuck you, motherfucker. It's almost wherever the fuck I want. It's not a problem, dude. But now, everybody asks these, each other, who are you voting for? And it's a fucking big deal. I could be like, hey, bro, fuck you. Yeah, uh, I, I, okay, so you got to move your hand from behind me, dude. You're no, like dude, smacking me like, and shit. I like, I like to touch him. <laughs> you know, there's some, there's some pros and cons for who, you know, who's who's voting, bro, you know, who's going to win, right? Boom. All right, let's go, you know, pros with Trump. You know, all the Venezuelans are out. No more coming in. Maybe. Maybe, which is... What well, I'm thinking rebel. is going to happen in November, right? There's going to be gonna massive gonna riots. Massive riots. No matter who wins. No matter who wins. It's going to be something that it's going to be uh, what's called like coordinated. No matter what candidate wins, there's going to be massive riots. There's going to be, let's say right. Trump wins, liberals, complete liberals, all Venezuelans. You know, it's massive riots. Boom, George Floyd. Remember like that? Fucking so smashing are you, businesses. Are you insinuating that the George Floyd was a uh, Oh, uh, that, fake? bro? That bro, fake that was crazy. Did he, are you? Insinuating I don't think it was fake, that, but that it was. Or- I, I'm not insinuating was nothing. Orchestrated to. I mean, bro, uh, they the had pellets of bricks, died. bro. Hold on, the man actually died. It's pretty mm. fucked up how but they killed him, though. Could that have been orchestrated? Well, supposedly oh my God, we're going into a deep, 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 deep subject deep right here, bro. Fucking rabbit hole right there. You dude. know what's crazy? That a rapper or somebody bought. George Floyd's tomb mm-hmm. and it was all gold. Yeah. Did you guys know that shit? Well, they were here, like carrying him around. They had like a big ass crowd. You know, you didn't see his funeral. Do you know he was a porn star? <laughs> Everyone knew he was a porn star, bro. You didn't know that. Uh-uh. David didn't know that. George Floyd medical summer Floyd's death a, a homicide. homicide. They ruled it. Yeah. Hmm. Testify to his infection. Autopsy report. Medical examiner, no pressure on the autopsy. Mm. So supposedly he didn't die of the neck. He was uh it was an overdose. Fennel overdose. Yeah, yeah that's what they say. That's but a big at the same time, that's a big statement, bro. That's a huge statement. They so had I might be wrong I mean, they for the guys that are the be on his neck. You're not saying that it, you're not saying it, but I made it sound like you said it. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't say that. It says uh let's see. Examiner said Floyd died after police subtitle restraint and neck compression caused his heart and lungs to stop. He said heart disease and drug use were factors, but not the top line causes. Uh-huh. He said Floyd had an enlarged heart that needed more oxygen than normal, as well as narrowed arteries. But mm-hmm. at the same time, I don't feel like they should have had the fucking knee on the neck. That was, so like course, yeah, that was crazy, totally, that was not unnecessary. That's uh, for sure not was. And I've seen like videos. Of, there's this fat dude. I don't know if you guys remember this is a while ago. Like a big ass dude, and they're like holding him down on the ground, and he's like, "I need my inhaler. I can't yeah, breathe. I got right. asthma. I got yeah, asthma, yeah. bro." Yeah. And he was laying on the floor, bro, and yeah. he's dying. I'm not saying every cop's like that, you mm-hmm. know. Every person's different in the world, you know. Not every cop is the same, you know. But you're saying you're saying all the cops are the same, Dave. Oh, in my case, so right now you just said it. <laughs> yeah, you I did it. not say shit. All right, so boom, Trump wins. Liberals are protesting. Biden wins, Antifa, <laughs> all the Republicans. No, I think Antifa is against the. Uh, or is it against Trump? Trump? Yeah. Yeah, they I are. Antifa is against Trump. I think they don't. They like fucking Trump. hate Trump. Oh, they hate Trump. I don't even know. That's who's pretty much know. set up the the storm of the Capitol, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, Antifa was uh, no, they didn't set up the. Wait, because because when when was supposedly was they, that? They, inc- inc- they incited it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They incited people to go in there. While you guys look this up, I'm going to mm-hmm. go. Take a leaky, right? I got oh, a yeah, piss yeah. too. Myself, so, so Antifa. Pause. pause. Yo, 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 yo. No worries. It no, I'll just wait in case it comes back. We keep talking. Um, move to group. Oh, right there. New York Times? Yeah, I'd hit the New York Times one. New York Times? Yeah, they usually You're have still some. still fucking liars, though? <laughs> yeah. Sometimes they are, but sometimes mm. they have good information. Trump wants to declare a third group. Uh, okay, yeah, so they hate Trump. Yeah. So, so that's who's going to be protesting with the libs. <laughs> yeah, we'll be fucked, honestly. But, oh, it's going to be but very getting interesting. Here's the bro. thing, though. They say that Antifa is, like, ran by uh, the opposing side. Like, it's ran by uh, the BLM group. I'm not positive that that's true, but mm-hmm. uh, as I was told by, like, uh, 
other people and like I've seen some news articles and mm-hmm. stuff. It says that one of the BLM uh, people got mm-hmm. in trouble for like buying a mansion, bro, with the the BLM funds. Oh yeah, dude. For Did sure. Did you see that yeah, shit? I seen that shit. That shit was I pretty crazy. I seen that shit for sure. And I was like thinking, like, damn, they got like billions of dollars mm-hmm. just coming into them, you know? Like for sure. Well, that was for sure engineered. Well, you remember there was, like, pellets of bricks and stuff on the side of the road. Mm-hmm. Like, why the fuck was there a pellet of bricks in, like, multiple locations, mm-hmm. you know, where people were rioting? And they said, like, uh, when they did storm the Capitol, there was, like, undercover uh, police officers and stuff there that were there, you know? Yeah. It's Dude, crazy. So, there's right here. BLM finances under fire. Only 33% of donations given to charity as excess paid millions, bro. <laughs> So only thirty three percent was actually given to charities, bro. <laughs> From well, what is this? WPDE dot com. I'm gonna go take shit now. Yeah, I'm gonna piss now. <laughs> shit or piss, I'm bro. I'm gonna shit and piss at the same time. Shit and piss on the same time. All right, so let me get you in and what we're talking okay, about. Okay, it smells like cannabis. <laughs> <laughs> so you remember when the BLM movement happened, right? Yeah. But oh, what the fuck? No, ads stop blowing up my viruses um you remember when the blm movement happened the people that received the donations bro yeah they were buying a bunch of shit yeah and only look so there was this article that only three percent of donations given to them that was from i don't know wpd.com that which i don't know let's see after raising nine millions boom this was new york times again they're on a they're on a streak after raising 90 million in 2020, Black Lives Matter has 42 million in assets. Let me screenshot this. Oh, you, you damn ad. Um, in the tragic whirlwind year of 2020, with racial justice protests prompted by the killing of black men and women by police officers, the Black Lives Matter Global Network Foundation raised 90 million much of its small donations from rank and file supporters. A recent tax filing from the group shown that by the middle of the last year, more than half of the money had been granted to small organizations were spent on consultants and real estate, leaving the foundation, the foundation with 42 million in assets. Well, do you know who created a... Uh Black Lives Matter? No. Uh, I believe it's three women. Three, three women? women? Three women uh, set it up. Mm-hmm. And I believe one of them has been buying houses everywhere. Mm-hmm. Not only, I feel like, uh, three, four houses. Mm-hmm. Uh, and we're talking about multi-million dollar houses. Yeah. So what is she? talking about exactly what I was talking about? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're, uh, about the multi-million well, the dollar homes that <laughs> yeah. these, ladies buy, these ladies are buying. <sighs> Are we uh, are we on telepathy, motherfucker? Or <laughs> <laughs> we're synchronized, bro. Yeah, yeah. Somehow or another, we're <laughs> yeah. This is uh, this is one of those parallel moments, bro. Yeah, no. Well, I'm telling you, oh, mm-hmm. sorry. Me and Davey have that little telepathy thing. You know, sometimes. So right? yeah, well, while you guys are taking this shit, you guys are talking to each other, yeah, bro. Yeah, well, you know, he <laughs> takes the shit, look, at staring at the wall while I stare at the stall. So I'm just like, you could just see like so a picture. We're back to back, uh-huh. you know, and we both take a shit at the same time. <laughs> 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 you guys are you guys are in a chakra a synchronization dude, pose, bro. Dude, you gotta do fucking religious things, you know. Oh yeah, bro. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Like you know, I kind of see it as like picture Queso's thinking, and then I'm taking a shit, right? Mm-hmm. Dude, I just you, see like you know a, weird? a bubble. When you start, when you start feeling like Queso's thoughts, when you start feeling their back <laughs> tense up, when, when you could feel them t- like pushing yeah. it out, you could feel their back tense up on your back. It's oh yeah, so bro. Weird. It's so awkward. yeah. <laughs> it's like it's like you guys are taking a shit on top of each other, right? Yeah, dude, it's like it's all holy fucking shit. <laughs> <laughs> what up, dude? <laughs> all right, let's uh, continue. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but definitely these uh, these three three new ladies. board members these that the group announced la- go down. Oh, down, 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 down. In an interview on Tuesday, Bowers, another new member of the board, said the picture painted by the document showed an organization retooling for their long haul. Go down, Javi. Promotion by Tumi. Was that Queso? <laughs> Is that Donnie? <laughs> Donnie! <laughs> <laughs> Me and Donnie could probably do See that. See the best part of this. Uh, massive organization. Massive amounts of money. No structure. No accountability. And no staff. Said Ashley Lates. As a St. Louis born activist who was involved in Black Lives Matter nationally in its early years. But has now spoken critically about lack of transparency within the group. Go down, Javi. 
Who even makes the decision and who writes the checks? Ms. Coulters, who stepped down as an executive director in May of 2021, said in an interview last week that the Associated Press within the group, they often refer to the experiencing of the past few year years as building the plane while flying it. They own the regret I have the BLM is wishing that we could have paused for one or two years to just do any work and just focus on the infrastructure, she said in an interview. Much of the outside critical attention on the group focused on her involvement. So she didn't do shit for the first two years. Yeah. But spent Last the month, money. New York she Magazine. Bought a plane and she spent all the damn money reported to go on that flights. funds raised in the foundation. That fucking look it, look it. Funds in the foundation were used to buy a house in California for nearly $6 million in cash in October of 2020. The tax filing shows property worths $5.9 million held by a Delaware company. The house was to be used, among other things, as an artist retreat. The, fil the filing said identifying information is not being released here due to safety and security concerns and threats to their community. To be said. a LM. GMF Professional security service. What service the fuck is that? Eight hundred forty thousand dollars just for security for the house. Served as an unpaid volunteer and a family family member. Jesus uh. Christ. Oh yeah, bro, that shit was a Which bullshit. To they give a birthday to party Floyd's? for her son held at the six million dollar house. No, they didn't give it to George Floyd's family. That fucking whore. Oh, is that one? That one out there? Patrice. Colors. One of the founders of the Black Lives Matter stepped down as an executive director. So that's who's talking Last about day. this. Damn. Oh, yeah. So it was very, very, very well spent like it always is in history, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so engineered, obviously. All Seven. this was engineered. Imagine how it's going to end up this November. Bro, everything's going to be fucked. It's going to be insane. Honestly, I feel like something... It is gonna happen. Everyone feels it's exactly it. It's like Christmas when right before COVID. <laughs> when right before COVID. Remember, remember when the news were in China? Where they were like, oh, hey, there's an epidemic in China. And when everyone's like, hey, you gonna get here? And it came here. And then out of nowhere, for some reason, it came here. But there could be speculations. I could be wrong. You know, CDC don't go after me. But supposedly, <laughs> <laughs> <We> <laughs> there was a speculation that could have not been a virus. Because it's a common cold. It's a common cold. The testing wasn't accurate. The vaccines weren't accurate. The vaccine oh. will get you more sick. Let me tell you this. My homie got the vaccine, right? Mm -hmm. He got a blood clot in his leg. The one that we had on our podcast, uh, Ike. Go check out Ike on SoundCloud, you know? But anyway, yeah, he got a blood clot and he got three of the uh, three of the... Doses and shots. Oh. And uh, recently he got a blood clot, bro, and his leg's still fucked up right now. And. Fuck, dude. You see, that's. We're just test rats, bro. For, for those that's crazy, those people, bro, to bro. think about. Mm -hmm. And he's a healthy dude, bro. Yeah, he's like as skinny as me, you know? Nah, mm -hmm. he's, he's, not he's a little fatter, yeah. He's getting up there lately. He's pretty whoa, big. Whoa, bro. whoa, he's, he's Don't body shame, bro. He's pretty big, bro. Like, he's like. He's a big dude, bro. Yeah, he's just tall. He's a pretty big dude, bro. He's like 6'2". Like uh -huh. For him to fucking... He told me, he's like, fuck, my leg's fucked up, bro. Damn. It's, like, it's fucked up because I've been making fun of him, but I hope he's all right. Damn, you know? bro. Yeah. You're a dick. Yeah. Well, I'm like, he's <laughs> well, like, what are you doing? I was like, yeah. So he could smile. Because <laughs> honestly, the first day we were playing with him, bro, he wasn't even talking. Like, yeah. we were playing games with that fool mm -hmm. on, on PlayStation. He wasn't even talking. Oh, well, yeah, dude. So shit. I was like, like, cracking jokes. You know my ass. Mm -hmm. I'm fucking weird. So I fucking yeah. say weird shit. It fucking... I was just trying to make him laugh, bro, and fucking... You could just tell. He definitely was well, like, this is, that's how, how much we really need to take care of our health, bro. Yeah. It's critical. The well, thing is, is like he the takes care of himself, they though. They lied to us, though. They, they lied did. to us. They said that this is 100% risk-free. Well, risk look, look what happened with the Purdue family. Look at that shit with the uh, documentary Painkillers, bro. bro. Have you seen that documentary? I haven't seen the documentary. Yeah, no. you have you actually. Ha we you talked have? about Purdue Family. We've talked. We've about talked them. about them, yes, but I've never. Uh, oh, you didn't watch that actual documentary. And I, you know, it's crazy. I try to go back, and I've been trying to find clips of it because, uh -huh. like, I don't remember us talking about it. Yeah. Because, like, dude. obviously, because we have so many fucking podcasts already that yeah. it's like oh, we dude. talk about so oh, much yeah. shit. So it's like you I can't try keep to up with it, right? You yeah. Can't keep up with yourself. So when the Bohemian Grove shit came out, mm -hmm. I started fucking. Uh, finding clips from the Bohemian Grove because I know that's what's popping right now, you mm -hmm. know. So I'm trying to use that as clips and shit, you know. Mm -hmm. So, but w the Purdue family, yeah, Purdue family. There, so they're a big. It was like a farm. It's like the Pfizer, right? It was like Pfizer, but 
It was a different family back in so the nineteen. Oxycontins, right? Huh? Oxycontin. Oxycontin. Yeah. Holy Oxycontin. shit! This links up to that that show I was telling you about, where that uh, girl's husband dies, uh-huh. and she like shoots him. Oh shit! I yeah, she sh- so she shoots him, and then she's with this family, right? And she's trying mm-hmm. to expose this family, and basically there's this guy, and he's like a, a journalist, like a big ass journalist in the movie or the show, and he's pretty much trying to expose this family for spending millions and millions of dollars on shit that they've done in the past that's like really fucked up Mm -hmm. but they own big pharma companies like they own uh, these pills for heart attacks and Mm -hmm. stuff and there's this guy on the show and he's like keeps falling over and passing out Mm -hmm. and he's like why the fuck am i doing this you know he he didn't start doing it until he started taking the medication for his heart and uh he realized that that makes that happen and the doctor pretty much told him you only got this much amount of time to live you know so but he stops taking the pills because he realizes that they're fucking with them. Yeah. And he starts doing other things like, you know, taking vitamins and mm-hmm. trying to do better shit, you know? Well, well, that, that, that's how, that's why this medical industry, it's just exactly how it was back in the 1950s, right? So this documentary, it talks about how this family pushed doctors to prescribe Oxycontin to people that didn't need it, which is low pain, right? And low pain. And you know how they got these doctors to buy the fucking pills, Davey? They would send hot chicks. Hot chicks. Bro. Hot chicks with coupons. It's like, hey, hey imagine, prescribe imagine this Imagine a hot little, little shoddy just pulls up to your shop and you're... And you're like a 40, 50-year-old <laughs> <40, 50 laughs> doctor, doctor, bro. Yeah, and a 20-year-old... Just flirting with you, bro. Hey, fucking how you doing, like, hey, sir? Touch hey, you in the fucking arm. Uh, hey, you want to get my coupons? You know, this is actually really good for, for, our, for your clients. Cause hey, I'd do it if you two came in there and told me that. I will sell you out, bro. I'll I sell you out. You're going to suck me up, too. Yeah. Both of you. You better no, so buy, you better <laughs> buy a kidding. million shares, motherfucker. going to well, suck me up. <laughs> Oxy, Oxy's pretty much that's like meth, right? Yeah. Right. So what is so that's the thing. They, no, I they, wouldn't do that, but that's how they think, you they know. They said it wasn't addictive. Especially you have power. They said it wasn't addictive, but it ended up being so addictive. And not only that, they said it was, they knew it was really good. Like it did do it did for some people it did help for people that like uh, did, didn't abuse it it did help, but so you think it was gonna work as good as it did? You think if they made all drugs legal that people would abuse them more? You think oh, they yeah, would be? Sure. I think a lot of yeah. people. So this is what would happen: people get if they once drug regulation starts, everybody everybody starts doing them drugs. Mm-hmm. Everybody starts doing drugs. Oh, they're legal. They're legal. A oh, lot of people are gonna die. They're gonna overdo it. Safer. A lot of people are gonna die. Mm-hmm. because of it but after those people start dying and people start realizing that you are gonna still die regardless if you're fucking regardless if they're if fake or not you're fake yeah. or not Get they're gonna be like they're gonna have to fucking <laughs> you know read uh they're gonna have to choose a different kind of uh way to go with life they're gonna be like fuck these drugs are still killing people even if they're fucking hey bro could you stop licking <laughs> that like doing that while i'm talking to you i'm having a rough time here you, <laughs> hey, what, how much you time you know are we doing to him huh temperature bro it's fucking cold as shit yeah, yeah, i know really? like, <laughs> I was i'm freezing we? both huh <laughs> how much time are we uh one hour and five minutes because he uh, right it there usually stops at 115 Really? Yeah, okay. yeah, 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 just, just, so you know. just so you know. Okay, so it sounds good. Yeah, yeah you can yeah. see the time right there. It's a one yeah, you oh can five. Just look at it, queso. Oh, well, I wasn't trying to be a dick. I'm yeah, no, no, no. Fuck yeah, fuck yeah. I'm just uh, letting. Here, you let know. me check. Actually, let me check. Yeah, I don't want. I don't want our shit ending. Yeah, because that happens, that to, happens us, to us Bobby. all the time. Bro. Dude, actually, I'm gonna just end it and. Re- That's what we need to start doing. Yeah, because our shit always does that, brother. One fifteen. One fifteen. Yeah, it's, it's weird. At a, we're at an hour, bro. Hell yeah, bro. Keep going. Quick. Fuck yeah, dude. We're we're fucking lit. Um, really but is. bro, so it, and it's crazy how they push that drug so much, bro. To this day, isn't it prescribed <laughs> to this day? <laughs> bro, he t- dude, he touched my foot, dude. <laughs> I didn't even mean to. And then we both just looked at each other and kissed. Like, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, dude. I'm sorry. I fucking hate this motherfucker sometimes, though, dude. Oh yeah, bro. It's all Keep good, bro. Put away from me, dude. But all right. So what is oxycontin? Oxycontin is a semi- semi-synthetic narcotic analgesic and historically has been... Is, did I say that right? Did yeah. I say that right? Yeah. yeah. Ana- analgesic. Analgesic. Where and are you at? Right the top? top yeah. Has been a popular drug f- yeah. of abuse among a narcotic abuse population. Oh, no shit. It's 
abused. Hillbilly heroin, kicker, OC, Ox, Roxy, Roxy Bird, Perk, Oxy. Oxy. R.I.P. Roxy. It's a street title. R.I.P. Monday the Roxy. From DA.gov. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. My dog just died, Javi. Her name was no Roxy. No way. His name was Oxy, really? Yeah, we Roxy. named her after after the perk. After the perk? Roxy. Yeah. Roxy? Oxy? When did he die? She was white like her, too. She just died. Yeah? She Two days ago. Too. Was she on Oxy, too? Three days ago. Did you guys give no, her No, she probably would have felt better. <laughs> I believe she had a heart No, are you guys, for real? Like, did she really die or no? No, yeah. she actually died, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. We're just desensitized and we just don't have no feelings no more, so that's why. Wait, was on. it the dog that that would pull up the black dog? No, no, oh God, no, <laughs> God, <laughs> poor Nelly. So wait, wait, how many dogs do you, do you guys have? We have three, three had had. <laughs> now it's two. It was a little Chihuahua. Oh, little Chihuahua. We found her in our garage. Someone was beating her. No way. Yeah, Somebody bro. was beating her, dude. Damn. They know for a fact. Yeah. Well, she had like blood on her nose and like half her ear was gone. No. Her ear kind of grew back just a little bit. Uh huh. But yeah, I think something attacked her. Oh. And then shit. she came into our garage and she was like sitting in there. Mm-hmm. And my brother went in there and fucking, uh, she bit his ass. So, but he grabbed her anyway and took <laughs> her in the house and put her in the cage. Shit. And then it like pretty much became his dog. And then mm-hmm. he moved out and then it became my mom's dog, you know? So like, Damn. her and my mom were like close. Like close. Oh, God, yeah. dude. What? Well, what was that, bro? They're scissoring? Just <laughs> close. <laughs> 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 I don't think that's how you refer to someone. Being that's true. how I refer to it, dude. dude. So, <laughs> however you want to see it is how you want to see it, dude. It's just close, you know. Very close. Yes. Yeah. We well, got it. We get it. <laughs> yeah. Like you and Queso, close. You know. <laughs> it's like. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh yeah, Not bro. That close. Maybe like this. No, but it's crazy how all these. Huh. Uh, We're like. Like this. <laughs> no. Well, maybe sometimes. It's like <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn, bro. It's crazy how these big-ass corporations and stuff could really control, like, uh, how they can sell drugs. Yeah. But we can't sell drugs. No, not know? the people. The people, yeah. for the people, it's completely illegal. Well. You need licensings. You need to go through these programs. Until we realize we're just a bunch of sheep. Yeah. And, uh. You either become a sheep dog or you stay a sheep. What's is a sheep dog? So like running the sheep. This is a metaphor because like the the dog that yeah. runs the sheep, right? Yeah. Like they just box out them and pretty much yeah. directs them. Yeah. yeah, because there's wolves out there. Mm-hmm. Now and the only motherfuckers that will go against the wolves is the sheep dog. Now you want to be a wolf, you want, but you can't be a a bully. So you gotta be a sheep dog. You gotta be <laughs> calm with the sh- with the sheep. Gotta be calm with the fleek. But as soon as a motherfucker shows up and tries to test your calmness, you show him that gangster and you fuck him up. And you go they them. Yeah. <laughs> you turn into a they them and then you're part of the crew. Like Ryan Garcia is about to be. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> hey, America. bro, Joe Biden, you see that Jeremy shit? You see that Joe Biden shit, though? No, that one you one? sent us, mm-hmm. the video? Bro, he has so many. Oh, so many. This mm-hmm. this recent one, Javi sent me. He's well, like, like, oh, <laughs> like the winner. I could have been a winner. You could have been a winner. Uh, and then and then some girl was like, huh. say her name. Oh, yeah, Lake say and her Riley. Name. Yeah, yeah. Wh- who's that? Who's that girl? She got killed by, Lake and Riley? by an immigrant, bro. Oh, what, Venezuela? Yeah, from Venezuela. Shh. Shit. Look, this is the video we're talking Say about. Say her. Maybe not from Venezuela. He might have been Honduran. Oh, I mean, fuck me. Uh, uh, right here. No, the boom right here. Here she's putting it up, bro. Oh. Yeah, no, no worries. This one you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, right? that's exactly the one I'm talking about. <laughs> what the fuck is he saying? Not winner. <laughs> Dirt. Wow. Here, I'll send this to you too, Javi. Yeah. If anything, I'll probably just try to clip it from there, but... Yeah, that's, um... That's fucking wild, bro. No, I just feel like it's easier, because Queso usually send the videos mm-hmm. to me, and then I'll just be able to find them right after the podcast. Yeah. So you could just look them right up, mm-hmm. you know. 
Oh, bro, Story that's a, a, but uh, he's not running no more, is he? Yeah. He can't. He can't he's possibly. Running against, he's running against. He Trump. cannot. Po- he. So that's that Nikki lady. Nikki Haley just dropped out of the primary. Li- Who's uh, that lady? Preliminaries. Who's Tommy? the lady? The mom. The mom of the girl. Yeah. Say her name. Who's that? Is she just some random lady? Or? I think it's some random lady. No, it's someone. It's someone. It's someone because I see. Who is she? Yeah, you should look up. Oh, it says right there, Marguerite Taylor Green. Yeah, right here. Yep. Who the fuck is that bitch? Oh my god, I can't believe this shit's real. Whoa, Confronts whoa. Confronts pres- President Biden, State of Union addresses about border security. She should out the name of the woman already killed by an undocumented immigrant. Biden so it's the same lady you're talking about. Up the pin of, with her name and said, "It's time to pass an immigration reform bill now." Holy shit, so he's going to make a reform, bro. Uh-huh. Holy so shit, that is that scary, That shit should have happened a long time ago already, though. Yes, bro, Me. but that's scary because the it depends. Most of these people that don't get caught. Yeah. What? Most the of these that people are that, are, that are just living day by day and don't give a fuck if the government doesn't. Get the, the well, look at the guy that that killed or that beat the fuck out of the cop, and how he oh, how he yeah. just walks out like he was four like guys. he's Tupac or something. They're yeah. all arrested. They were in California. My homie, uh, I went to the shooting range, and they told me they mm-hmm. they told me they was like, oh, they're fuck those guys. They're already in fucking jail. Yeah, that's crazy. He said that uh, what's it called? Wherever they were at, and New York might stand for that, but the like other states won't. Yeah. It's like, holy fuck, bro. It's like, so other states will fucking take their hands. Like, that's what's going on in Texas, bro. Did you see what's going on in Texas? Nah. The farmland and all that shit that's been on fire? Really? Oh, kind of like the thing that the farmers in Europe are (coughs) fighting for? Bro. They're like... Holy shit, I have heard about that stuff in Europe. All the cattle shit, all the things, and all the things, they're like, all their stocks have been... On fire. So, okay, so, so I don't know if you know, but Texas closed their borders. Too, bro. Yellowstone's fucking real, bro. So, <laughs> so they're be, they're closing all their they're yeah, closing all their borders. Food Texas is, mm-hmm. and they're not letting anybody uh, in or out. Mm-hmm. So this is what the uh, president Biden did. He fucking put a uh, a stop to them arresting any illegal un- uh, immigrant coming mm-hmm. in. So Texas cannot arrest anybody, bro. They're still probably arresting them, though, right? Most likely. I hope so. Because that... Well, some are. are, Some are. I'd hope so, bro. But that's going against fucking lawful orders. And who knows, bro? That's probably treason if they try to think about it like that. Mm -hmm. And not only that, governor or the the mayor of of Georgia, Mm -hmm. he just said that he's with uh, Texas and they will be sending people out there, Mm -hmm. like reinforcements to Texas. To help them through this fucking time. And if people are going to start doing that, bro, other states are going to unite together. Besides Colorado, we're fucking idiots. Yeah. We're letting all these people in and they're just, just giving them two years free housing. To move out. Two years free housing, bro, and uh, hotels two are kind of getting shit. fucked. A thousand bucks every month. And I got to pay fucking $2,800 for rent every motherfucking month. Oh, you, <laughs> you see how they made uh, Colorado they made that shit illegal for Bullshit. them to be cleaning windshields? Really? Did they really? Yeah. They're still doing they it. They made that shit illegal, bro. So if uh, the police sees them, they can arrest them, bro. Some guy the other day, bro. Javi, wow. came up to my house, asked me if I wanted my window cleaned, used the hose, cleaned off my windshield, and then asked for $15. For, yeah? Yeah. It's pretty fucked up, Javi. Pretty fucked up, all right? He used his own hose, bro. He used my hose at my house for my lawn. What would you do? Um, <laughs> sorry, man. No money, bro. No money, primo. I'd be like, bro, I just wish my fucking car, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> no, what the fuck? I was like, matter of fact, you give me fifteen dollars, dude. That's how much the car wash is, motherfucker. I know you got it. I know that month, that monthly payment came in, motherfucker. It's the beginning of the month, bitch ass. Wake up, wake up, wake up! It's the first of the month. Yeah. Get up, get up. No, but get in all up, seriousness, this up. is scary. Bro. Oh, so able to. Where, where was like it at, hobby that you're talking about? The farmers, Europe. Oh yeah, yeah. So uh, something happened in Europe, 
where potatoes or something, right? It was well, with the potatoes? I don't know something with the farmland in Europe, and they tr- something about the 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 big corporations trying to buy their land out, right? And then the farmers are like, Nah, fuck no. Well, not only that, they're but they're, they're not letting them sell they're their they're their them potatoes. So right? say, they're not letting them so grow. Let's say, yeah, they're doing let's something. Let's say this, bro. You work all day. Mm-hmm. Let's say you work all day, like you uh, get all your cuts, and then at twelve, you still have you still have cuts until six right and mm-hmm. i'm like all right you got to keep working but the rest of that money is mine mm-hmm. you got to keep working bro because i don't care what what you say that rest of the money is mine what you made in the morning all right you could keep that mm-hmm. that's your earning of the day you got to keep working the rest of the day for them Fuck. and that's what's going on with these workers these fucking farmers they're making them let's say they make a whole field and crops right uh-huh. and they they buy crop. They buy by crop. So let's say they buy one crop, and they're like, uh, <clears throat> "All right, we bought this crop, but if you don't get it in certain amount of time, then you have to keep cutting that crop for us." You know, like mm-hmm. it's you have to pay us. You know, it's like mm. money. It's like weird. Yeah. <laughs> here, so there's a farmers' <laughs> protest takes <laughs> in Europe and beyond. So here in I don't That's know what so scary, source it is. American University, Washington D.C. No farmer, no food. Mm, no farmer, no food. So yeah, that's pretty much what you're talking about. Farmers across Europe are organizing with in the regions and events across the borders, expanding a protest movement centered around disagreement with EU farming policies. Farmers began protesting in Europe spring 2023 in Poland, Romania, gain a cheaper good that does not follow EU standards and therefore pres- present Unfair competition. Unfair comp- competition in the market. Those initial protests began spreading to Germany, France, Italy, Greece, and Spain in recent months, drawing similarities in the 2019 protest against the a nitrogen, nitrogen emission, emission crackdown in the so Netherlands. Not only that, their uh, their the fuel, their mm. fuel is also getting cut down. Uh. They're like charging them for fuel, mm-hmm. like way too much fuel. Yeah, and they're. Uh, they're just overpricing everything like they are here in the United States, bro. Oh, we're mm-hmm. getting fucked with the overpricing. But did you see in Canada, bro? You thought it, you think it's bad here, bro, in Canada for fucking some steaks? I seen that it was like two hundred dollars, bro. Two hundred. Fuck! I pay ten dollars a steak here. Ooh. Four eat, steaks, I pay ten dollars a steak. You be eating some nasty steaks, then? What are you Over eating? there, no. The ones that I get are ribeyes. Food forty dollars for four steaks with ribeyes. Yeah, that's fucking yeah, ass. that's what I get. Gas. Motherfucker, I'm I need not to take eating a no piss. Cheap shit. Sometimes I even Keep get going, me guys. some some flaming mignons, yeah, motherfucker. You call me oh, broke. You be getting some. Flaming yeah, motherfucker, I'm a flaming so mignon, I, motherfucker. So that's what I ate the other day, huh? Yeah, I took it out of the freezer and everything, dude. That, that was shit Steve's. Was bomb. It was yours, actually. <laughs> that was Steve. It was yours, dude. Oh. I cooked it up. I made it. I made it ready for me and everything. Dude. I bought some chicken and shit, you know. I know, I Start fucking making. ate some of it yesterday. I'll fucking jerk you off, dude. You touched my chicken. That'd be nice. I actually did touch it. Good God. What, what happened to the jerk off, dude? I was kind of excited for that. What do you think's going to go on, David? You think we're going to fucking end up living off of Bill Gates and fucking uh, fake meat? So I hope we don't make... Bro, I can't believe they have fucking 3D printed meat. Well, that's what... Oh, we haven't even told Javi about that shit. They're making nope. 3D fucking printed meat. Now, if you go to in and out motherfuckers, watch out. They give cancer. They, it's, I told you, it says that in every spot every in California. Every fucking spot. Goddamn. Every single restaurant that you go to in California says um, this may cause cancer due to... Products in our food. Yeah. Every single one. And that's crazy as fuck because they don't do that over here, you know? Yeah, because we don't, we don't have that law that's passed, you know, to... To say, well, only California does, right? Yeah. Yeah, Javi, did you know they have 3D printed meat? Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're making 3D Possible printed meat? fucking meat now. Impossible no, meat? Yeah, or but it's 3D printed. It's 3D printed. It's 3D printed. Oof. Gives it the same texture. They uh, even put juices in it. Would you that, eat it? Oh, hell no. You probably, you probably you know already what, are. You know what that reminds me of? Huh? You remember that SpongeBob episode when... Uh, oh, with the patties? When the patties oh, when they were... Butt, they make them into, like... <sighs> That gray substance, yeah. they come out like shit. That's all real, bro. All that shit's going oh, on right now, dude. damn, bro, yeah. All that shit's going on right now. They even did that in, uh, Remember, I don't know if you guys watched Mr. the Simpsons Krabs episode. Remember, bought out. He gets bought out. 
And then they start doing that. Yeah, because Mr. Krabs just wants the money, you know, that little motherfucking shysty uh, motherfucker. Little little greedy fuck. that, little that's crab. someone that you look at. <laughs> <laughs> really, for real, though, that's, that's what people, that's what these fucking guys in the government <laughs> are, bro. Fucking greedy little crabs. They're Mr. Krabs, dude. They're fucking grabbing all the, all the heathen things, you know, just... I don't know. <laughs> oh, yeah, bro. <laughs> so yeah, that shit was crazy, bro. Hey, Mr. man. Crabs, that shysty motherfucker. Hey, man. Yeah, dude. Hey, it's been uh, an hour, 20 minutes, bro. Mm. Do you want to have to wrap it up, bro? Thank you guys so much for coming. Oh, yeah. I'm glad. This shit was fun, bro. This shit went by fast as fuck, I dude. I know. Shit went by too fast, bro. Too much we fun. Should, we should do some meth lines before we leave. Some Some oxy. <laughs> no, I mean, in case we've been trying to stay away from that recently. No, yeah. We're, we're strictly kind of meth right now. Just meth? Meth and we're heroin? We're meth enthusiasts right now. Meth and heroin? Her- shooting up heroin in between, your like, your, where's, where's your uh, fingers, bro? Let me see your, uh... <laughs> <laughs> I guess... I guess this is it, boys. Oh, go, uh... If you guys don't know who we are, go check us out. Oh, yeah, yeah. Candy Show. Yeah, YouTube. I mean... Uh, I kind of said it in the intro. I don't kind of remember what I said in the in the I beginning. Remember. I don't remember. <laughs> Spotify. So I'm gonna have to review Rumble. that. Yeah. I'm gonna have to review that TikTok, and see how Instagram, how Facebook. bad it was. No, we did good. I think you. Were, I think we were great. I think this was great. <laughs> this was great. Yeah, we need to do it again. <laughs> For sure, you do it again. Protect our borders. This is uh, number two. Number dos. Yes, sir. Senor. I wonder if there's a way the I could share the playlist with you, so we could put them all in one playlist. Yeah, like one from yeah, ours, yeah. one from yours, one from Euro, ours, one from Euro. yours. Because I made a playlist for uh-huh. YouTube Music. I figured out how to put them on YouTube Music. Uh-huh. I didn't know you could. Did you know you could do that? Yeah, yeah. I have yeah, a certain playlists for my YouTube. So I have playlists for the for the podcast tutorials, then the podcast podcast, and then just like the. Are shorts. you gonna go to uh, sneaker con? Maybe, maybe not. I'll see though. I'll hey, see. Let's it depends go do on some interviews. Yeah, that'll we want to go do dope. some interviews. Or <gasps> Bring the diamond tester. Yeah, <laughs> let's go. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to. Yeah, uh, um, see yeah, no, for sure, go. we're gonna have to go. Let's go. It's March. Uh, what March 29th, Queso? I think so. Saturday. It's mm-hmm. on a Saturday. Go, yeah, March this 29th. We don't have to go all day. We're just going yeah, for, for a couple hours. Bit. And then well, leave, what time you know? they start? Because they, they they be there early, yeah, early, right? Yeah, so we'll be we there. Can early go like midday or so, or early. It doesn't fuck matter. Around, talk to some yeah, ask yeah, questions for sure. And I'm gonna have to get that uh, that adjustment from for for the road mics, oh, for yeah. the phone and the road mic, so I could boom, boom, or have Can two, one for me and then one for the person. <coughs> Is there a way to like connect no, your road? I want. I wish there was a way to like connect it. Wirelessly, you know, like if they had a transmitter, there yeah, there is, there is, there's, 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 there's has an adapter. adapter. It's just expensive. Uh, is it oh, expensive? I ha- oh, we have them all. I could just borrow them from Enrique. Oh, yeah. I ask him, I ask him if I could take them. And we could rent them. Tell him we'll rent them. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he'll just let us borrow. I'm pretty sure. Nah, it, it's better to rent because yeah. yeah, yeah. There's we'll more, more we'll of an asset. Yes, yeah, sir. Take care of them better. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. We'll talk. All right, we outie. I need to set up because family's waiting, bro. We out here.